What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Strike Out Beer. Quick beer reviews with your pals, Alan and Rapid Dave. I'm Rapid Dave. Yo, why do you always get so angry when you say your name? <laughs> I'm Alan, by the way. <laughs> What's up, bud? Just in case you weren't sure. Um, Today, I hadn't had a false idol beer in a while, especially for like quick beer reviews, so I'm pretty excited about this one. False Idol Wolf Hunter, German-style Pilsner, 5% alcohol, and this is one of my favorite beers from there. They make Pilsners fantastic out there. Yes, they do. Oh, great. We're doing this again? We're totally doing it. Oh, man. Okay, hold on. Let me get this Let me get this towel ready. <laughs> um, this is German Pilsner, and the Hunter is coming. That's all they got on Untapped for this. Um, it does have an average score of 3.79 out of 5, mm -hmm. um, out of 179 rating, ratings. Again, it's a, a German Pilsner beer. So let's, uh, let's get into it. All right, cool. We like pills, right? I do. I like pills a lot. This big, one, this big is called, fan of the pills. I like big pills, and I cannot lie. <laughs> I'm telling you. Yeah. Um, you were so worried. Oops. You were so worried. Look at it. Perfect. You need a little bit more. I think you're a little shorthanded over there. There you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I like the can, too. Now That's you got to cool. take a picture now with the can upside down. Oh, okay, cool. That'll be our thing going forward, I think. Yeah. Just cans upside. I don't mind upside down cans. Yeah. You like innies, outies, cross-eyes, slopes? <laughs> no. What? What are you doing? It smells good. I'm smelling the beer. Oh. I'm looking at the beer. I was like, come on. I, I, I'm, I'm giving you some gold over here. You're just going to look the other yeah, way? Yeah, yeah, I am. <laughs> and he's down, he's like, Cheers. What <laughs> Cheers. Oh. Ah, that's the good stuff right there. Oh, yeah. That is the good stuff. It's got some bite to it, though, too. Yeah, that aftertaste. Um, that's really good, though. Mm-hmm. I really I like enjoy it. They have, they have a great place out there in North Richmond Hills. Uh, we call it part of what is it, part of the triangle. You know yeah. what I mean? You got Bedford. Uh, what's in Bedford? Uh, the Turning Point. Turning Point. You got Brutal Beer Works. And then you got uh, Falls Idol. They're all like right within a couple miles of each other. Great little area to go to, especially for craft beer. And, and Falls Idol is a it, really cool place. It, congratulations to Falls Idol, Hoppensting, and Brutal being voted the top three breweries in the DFW area. Nice. So, oh, is it D Magazine or whatever so, that was? Something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah nice. they, were, they were the top three. Nice. So, yeah, congratulations. The voting, was, the voting was out there, uh, you know, for people to come out. If you're on any of their social media, you know, that's something you should probably pay attention to as well. If they're saying, hey, you know, vote for us or something like that, get at least, you know, at least uh, throw something out there. Help them get some recognition. Yeah. You know, your favorite breweries. Mm -hmm. That's really what um, helps them stay valid, gets them out there. Yeah. You know? Yeah, they do. They do. They doing the Lord's work out there. They are. I they like their are. bar. I like sitting. I like sitting at the bar. Yeah, um, they got a long bar. They do. Big long bar. Yeah, and they usually have the game on or something like that. And then if you're feeling like you're there with some friends, you want to sit on the patio. They lift up the doors, and it's, if it's a nice day, and you sit on the patio and just chill, man, just soak in the sun, relax. You know, it's not. It's like a. There's something between that and the and the main road. So you're kind of isolated. A little bit, yeah. Not a lot of traffic. It's not as loud. It's a car it's just, dealership right there. Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah, we'll use car dealership. And it, it really is kind of secluded. You know, you're just off the main road and it's like, hey, there you are. Yeah. Not bad. Oh, yeah. it's good beer. It's it, it's pretty tasty. I, I really like it. It, it. it does have a decent amount of bitterness with it. Um, it says NA on the IBUs. I don't know that that's correct. Uh, it's just, yeah, it's the, the a Pilsner lot, style a lot of or whatever. They just don't, they don't put the IBUs out there anymore. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Yeah. You just don't. So we got perfect color. It's got a. It's a nice yellow. It's pale. The clarity is. Uh, it's pretty clear, but it's just a bit, a bit, a tiny bit of haze. Just a little bit of that off color, that off white or uh, really off good. yellow or whatever. Perfect carbonation. Both these poured great, especially upside down out of this can. <laughs> can art's fun. I like the can art too. Five out of five on that. The crushability's there. It just pilsners. Um, German pilsners have that aftertaste. You know what yep. I mean? Yep. And uh, which is a great taste. Like I'm not saying like it, it's got this bitterness. Like it's a bad taste. It's a good taste. It's a good bitterness. Yeah. Um. I I enjoy that that flavor. Let that you know style, you're drinking that, nice little beer. Yeah. Right. Yeah. It's it's got a good mouth feel to it. Oh yeah. You know you kind of feel like a man when you drink it. There you go. A manly man. Yeah. Most Type people. Of man who built the Eiffel Tower out of bronze and steel with <laughs> his bare hands. Steel. <laughs> his bare hands. <laughs> I always get, but I get teased when I drink lagers and pilsners and kolsch's. They're like, you know, they're, yeah. these IPA guys or these stouts. I'm like, have fun. But your your German pills are a different. A they're different. a different beast. Yeah, they're a little bit different. Yeah, Czech pills is good. Italian pills is good. Oof, Czech pills is something else. But this German pills, they always and they do 
they put out some good pilsners. They really do. So check them out. False Idol. I think it's falseidol.com, if I'm not mistaken. I feel my beard growing as I drink it. I can't get my beard to grow anymore. It's done. Yeah? yeah. It's done? Yeah. It, it, I barely have to trim the bottom anymore, but the sides I trim eh, about once a week. Okay. And a pretty good amount of hair falls off that. But yeah. I think it, I was going to go one solid, um, like an eight all the way around. Okay. But I got like a fat round face. So then it just maybe look like I got like a, a tire around my damn. I don't know. I don't know if I wanted to, I don't want, I'm not ready for that. Okay. Cause I've always had a little bit longer here. So it kind of shaped. Right. Yeah. I don't know if I got, I lose like 50 pounds. You maybe don't I'll know if you it. can handle the fat face. I don't know. Don't like know that's just some people, off. I don't think so. Too fat. Yeah. Well, that's what you get for giving up the XL dream and coming over to the dark side with the two X shirts. Once you buy the two X, you're like, I don't need to go anywhere else now. I'm good. It's it's so comfy. Yeah. You're like, I got so much more room for activities here. Yeah. Uh, Big thumbs up. Wolf Hunter, German pills, really great, delicious, good, and good for you. Corn Island, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. We appreciate you guys. As always, I'm Alan. Rabbit Eve. Talk to you later. Deuces.